This senior spotlight is brought to you by Rockin' Sons Tire and Auto. East end of Adams in LeGrand. Go see JB and the boys. He's a football player. He's a senior. He's Eli Basinius. Here it is. Eli, your brother's been on here before. Yeah. A couple of years ago. Um, uh, football. Let's let's talk about that first. Um, it, senior year. There's 20 of you guys. Um, like, what what got you into football originally? Uh, you know, like Optimus, you know, very young age when I was in like fourth grade. Started playing then. I've just been playing ever since. Been playing ever since. Uh, yep. you, what position do you play? I'm a tight end and D end. Nice. And uh, with with football, like this this season, 20 seniors. Um, obviously, like a couple of your years of football have been affected by COVID this year. Hopefully not. Um, what's your goals? What's your personal goals for, for this season? Uh, my personal goals is to help the team out as much as possible wherever I can, whenever I can. So, you know, hopefully uh, win a state championship. That's the end goal for the team. Yeah. So the team chemistry, what's that like? I feel like this team, we've been playing together for a long time. We're all like multi-sport athletes, most of us. And I feel like we all have great chemistry. You talk about multi-sport athletes. What other sports do you play? I'm a wrestler and I play baseball. What, what's your favorite sport? Probably wrestling. <coughs> Wrestling's your favorite sport? The yeah. hardest sport? Yeah. Wrestling's tough, man. It mm -hmm. really is. Um, if you like if you had to choose one or the other, would you rather be in a coma for ten years or in prison for five? Uh I think prison for five. Me too. Yeah. I wouldn't want to wake up and have people that have died and had kids and you know, ten yeah. years is a long time, dude. That's a long time. And it would just be mentally taxing to, I mean, both would be mentally taxing, but it would be really weird to not know what happened for the last 10 years. Yeah. Um, sports wise, uh, you, you say wrestling is your favorite. Why? Um, you know, it's like, like you said, it's the most challenging sport. I feel like it pushes you the most. I feel like, you know, uh, it like makes you become like a really good person. Like you wrestling translates over to a lot of things, you know, you just gotta like push through things, be tough, persevere. And I don't know, I just, yeah, it's definitely by far my favorite sport. Do you like the one-on-one -on -one aspect of it? Yeah, that, well, yeah, it's a one-on-one -on -one aspect, but also, like, there is also a team aspect to it that some people don't know. Well, yeah, I mean, you're scoring points for your team, but, I mean, yeah. it, it's pretty one-on-one. -on -one. I mean. Yeah, yeah. It's the epitome of one-on-one. -on -one. I mean, it's how, it's how combat starts. You know what I mean? Like, that's the original sport. Yeah, yeah. Is is hand-to-hand -hand combat. Um, with, with football, um, you, you, you play tight end, um, mm -hmm. the, the, that, that position, um, how involved is that in the LeGrand offense? Uh, it's a very involved position. It's involved in both the run game and pass game. It's like, it's a, it's a very involved position. You gotta know what you're doing. Otherwise there's a lot of plays that are based off of tight end. Yeah, of course. I mean. Yeah, definitely for, for our offense at LeGrand. Yeah. Um, we go on the road. We play Weezer. We have three away games before we have a home game. Um, is Has the team talked about that? Like this, I mean, it's basically a road trip. Yeah, um, I, haven't, I don't know. We haven't talked about a ton with the team, but I know it's going to be tough this year with only having three home games and a lot of away games, but uh, yeah, yeah it's, it'll be tough. Road games are tough, man. I mean, it's yep. tough on families to, to get there. It's just, it's, it is what it is, though. I mean, we just got to do it. We're ranked seventh in the state in the coaches poll. Um, I, I mean, I think we have a better team this year than we do last year. I mean, what are your thoughts on that? Uh, yeah, I agree because uh, most of the starters, we have a lot of starters returning from last year and some of them, some of them have been stars since they were sophomores this year, and now they're seniors. So I think we've got a lot of experience on this team now. Yeah, I'd, I'd have to agree. Like, I mean, we did lose some really key people, but at the same time, overall, I think we're we're going to be better this year. Yeah, I agree. Um, so if if you had to choose one or the other, would you rather be uh, stuck on an island for the rest of your life, like tropical, or stuck in the in the snow, like in the Arctic? Definitely stuck on an island in like tropical. No, you don't like the Arctic? The, you know. I mean, yeah, I just I'd rather have it be warm. Yeah, right. Yeah, cold. Yeah, definitely. Me too. Um, what are your hobbies outside of sports? Um, 
a lot of hunting and fishing and like getting outdoors doing stuff with the family what do you like to hunt uh elk and deer and you know turkeys ducks everything any ever hunt any predators i have gone i've shot at a few bears before i haven't killed one yet but you know i, I like predator hunting i like coyote yeah. hunting i like uh bobcat yeah and birds but i got like so i used to hunt turkey which pheasant hunting is phenomenal there yeah um, but when I moved to the west side, I got pretty spoiled because the duck and goose hunting over there is way better than yeah. over here. Um, for, do, you, do you have your phone on you? I do have my phone on me. Pull it out. All right. Got What's it. the last song you listened to? The last song I listened to? Yeah. Um, it is Horses Are Faster by Ian Mintick. What, what was the last name? Ian Munsek. Ian Munsek. Horses are faster. Nice. Mm. Um, do you like pineapple on pizza? No. What's your favorite food? Favorite food? Yeah. Mm, I don't know. Uh, I like I like all sorts of foods, but burgers are pretty good. Like a homemade burgers. burger. That's pretty good. Just straight, Just a burger. I mean, homemade Simple. homemade burgers are pretty good. Like homemade elk burgers, those are good. Oh yeah, yeah, uh, elk, yeah. But yeah, you got to have elk burger that's got a little fat in it. Yep, yeah, to have a good burger, you got to put a little pork fat in there or something. Mm -hmm. um, what do you want to be when you grow up? Um, not quite decided yet, but something along the lines of maybe agricultural engineering or any sort of engineering. Mm -hmm. Something you like want to go to college? Yeah, for sure. Where? Where do you want to go? Um. Uh, I could go somewhere in Idaho, like Idaho, University of Idaho, maybe thinking about that or Montana State University. Is that where your brother goes? Montana? Yeah, Montana State. State. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I thought. Um, all right. We'll end it with this. Uh, I, I pretty much ended the same with everybody. Um, I'm a senior in high school and I don't have a place to play football. Why should I come play football at LeGrand? Um, LeGrand football, you know, like. It's the best. We got the best coaches, I believe, the the best coaches in Oregon and some of the best, like, the best place to be playing football because, you know, you learn so much. It's all about being a good person here and, uh, you know, got really great culture in the Grand. East Oregon, he's LHS senior Eli Basinius. I'm Dodzy. Eli, I appreciate you. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Thanks, Eli. I appreciate it. Once again, none of this is possible without Rockin' Sons Tire and Auto Hub right here in the Grand. It's the East End Adams, the old Wendell's Corner. If you need anything for your vehicle, go see JB and the boys. Eastern Oregon, I appreciate you. I'm Dodson, and I'm out.